What's going on St. Louis? This is Brad in STL. I'm Jaquise Hart. And welcome to another episode of STL Food for Thought. Yes, today we are in the Soulard area and we've come to this area specifically to show you some of the best restaurants that this area has to offer. So, should we start with our normal? Get a drink? Yeah, let's grab a beer. Let's do it. Let's get it, man. All right, so we're at McGurk's to have a drink. We just got off work a little bit ago, and so, uh, what do you think? I don't know, I look forward to trying this place. I've heard the patio is really, really pretty, really, really beautiful. A lot of people tend to come here from just one scenic patio, so I look forward to seeing that. Yeah, it's one of the most beautiful patios in all of St. Louis, so let's grab a beer and show them what they have to offer. Let's do it. serene I feel like you know you could come here for a few different things of a nice little lunch meeting yep. a business meeting you can come here for a nice date or a girls night out something yep. like that you can come here at nighttime I've so my impression on this place like for many many years in my 20s I'd come here just at night time. and then I forgot that this was a little daytime yeah. place that you could come here with family and friends I love it. I mean there are kids over there but I've, I've never seen a kid in this place but it's, it's uh, beautiful place the flowers so I, I actually feel like I'm out of town like I don't feel like I'm in st. Louis yeah. right now I feel like I'm in somewhere like New Orleans or, yeah. or something like that's just how this place makes me feel so what do you think Jackie's this place is really 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 cool I would definitely come back here I want to try the lunch I want to see if they have a nice brunch menu this is definitely yeah. like date night bring your girl have a nice little afternoon lunch type of spot and I'll tell you what well uh you got, a little, you got a few more sips, but uh, let's go to another place, grab another drink, and uh, continue to explore Subar. Let's do it. All right, so we're continuing our afternoon work shenanigans. Okay, we're right here at Henry's, still in the Soulard. So, Brandon, man, tell me a little bit about this place. So this is my second time here, but the first time I came here was on the day of the Stanley Cup parade. I also found out Anthony Davis got traded to the Lakers, so I came here to celebrate. Okay. All right. Well, you know what? I look forward to seeing what it looks like on the inside. Let's take a tour. Let's get something to drink, man. All right, go, go. videographer had to leave what yeah. do you think you know i like it there the atmosphere is cool it's nice it's fun it's unique you know you can sit in the boat you can drink in the car whatever hey and it's 6 30 and they had two dollar beers two dollars and it's the freshest bud select you'll ever have because yeah. literally what six blocks down yeah, like the, uh, yeah it's down there so uh man let's uh, let's grab some meat let's do it i'm hungry let's get it all right, so now that we've had a few drinks, we're here at Mission Taco. It's 100 degrees, so I know we weren't craving too yeah. much, but you can always crave tacos, right? That's true. Always down for a good taco. Have you been here before? I have never been here before. Oh, 
that. So I've actually had almost everything on their menu. I've had every taco on their menu at least twice. So uh, uh -huh. you ready to have some tacos? I'm ready for a good taco. Oh man, had several good tacos. So. <laughs> All right, well, let's try it. Let's enjoy them. this place and I know the tacos are really really good I feel like you can't go wrong with a good chicken taco or a good fish taco sure. so like I mean a good fish taco sounds good I see they got something here the Baja fish yeah yeah Baja fish Chipotle shredded cabbage queso fresco so should I should I tell people that they don't have the barbecue duck right now supply chain man Barbecue, ooh, that sounds good. Oh, man, now, I, I legitimately have gotten it here every time I've come here. Really? For the last six years. Okay. That sounds really good. Six, yeah. I would like to try that. One day, Mission Taco. Another? <laughs> one day. Maybe I'll have it next time we come. One day, we'll be on the seasonal taco list right there. But yeah, I think we'll, uh, when she comes up here, we'll just order an assortment and uh, cool. eat some yeah. tacos. All right, Mark. So, what's up, y'all? I'm Mark Hell from Mission Taco. Here we got some tacos. Um, uh, Let's start over here with this taco right here. This is a fried fish taco. It got all your just typical like lettuce, pico, a little bit of crumbly cheese on top. Over here, this is our grilled chicken taco. This is actually new. We just got rid of the duck taco. So this is kind of like a fusion between the duck and the grilled chicken. Got barbecue sauce, lettuce, pickled onions on top. Over here, this is a carne asada taco, classic street taco, arugula, crumbly cheese, carne asada, some avocado serrano sauce on the bottom. This is the beef tinga. This is a onion radish salsita uh, with a stewed beef and then a little bit of guacamole on the bottom. So yeah, these are just some of the classic tacos. Uh, if you ever have a taco, these are all flyers. So uh, you can uh, come by and grab one anytime. Food is here. This looks amazing. Fire. It looks amazing. I don't know which one you want to try first. I think we're going with that grilled chicken just because I missed the barbecue duck, as I've stated already. I miss it. Apparently, it's really good. <laughs> this is the most comparable thing they have instead of duck. They have okay. the uh, okay. chicken in there, so I'm going to get that one. Yeah, go ahead. I think I'm going I'm to grab this fish right here. Oh, boy. Oh, that looks good. That looks oh, good. Look at that. That feta cheese looks so fresh. Just take a look at that. My goodness. Well, what's the proper way to eat a taco? You go like, I'm one of those people, I'll eat it from the side like this. Yeah. I don't know, man. You just got to go straight in the middle. Straight in the middle? <laughs> oh, man, I'm spilling out. <laughs> I don't know. Let's get it. Oh. Oh. This it. Mm. This hits the spot every time. So we've been all around Soulard. We just yep. wrapped up, had some Mission Taco. What, yep. what do you think about Soulard as a after work kind of place? I really like this area. It's really trendy. It's really unique. It's beautiful. There's a lot more in this area than what you would normally think. Seriously. It feels like you're out of town. It feels like you're kind of on a vacation in a sense. And if you're from the area but never been to this area, like it definitely feels like you're you're visiting somewhere out of town. And that's what I love about it the most. Hey, it's about vacationing in your own city. So yep. stay tuned to find out where we're gonna end up next. Thank you.